Hello and in this video we're going to talk very briefly about how to calculate weighted means. Now this is the simplest maths statistics video I've, I've ever done but it's a very important predicate to some of the stuff we're going to be covering in the future so I thought, I thought I'd cover it and it can be useful in its own right. So we know that if we wanted to calculate the mean of all these numbers we would just add all the numbers together and divide by the, the, the number of um, entities that's an that's an equally weighted mean because each of the each of the numbers has an equal contribution to, to the average but what if we wanted to have a weighted mean so the first two are worth 40 percent and the others are worth five percent well all we need to do is multiply each each number by its weight so for the first one we'd have 6.3 times 40 and uh, same for all of those, we then need to add those values up. So add up all those w weighted items. And then instead of dividing by by the number of items, we're going to add up all the weights, which obviously in this case add up to 100 because it's percentage. And then it, we just take those two values. And instead of dividing by the number of items, we divide by the weights. Uh, we get... Oh, uh, um, what what weighted average there? Uh, where the first scores were weighted eighty percent and the others were weighted five percent. The I think to note about that is that um, if we think about where with the regular average we're dividing by the number of uh, items. So the way to think about that is is each each. Uh, value is just weighted by one so we're not actually doing anything different when we calculate a, a weighted average anyway that was a very simple video but i hope that was helpful thank you